so we did listen about uh, the advice or had for chemo or not using chemo surgery or not using surgery, whichever uh, things are most suitable need to be done but now since i am in his opd and i'm aware of the patients who come and different uh, levels of interventions needed uh, now we would uh, request from sir his opinion about the need of surgery because that's also important in certain stages and chemo alone may not help radiation alone may not help and ayush alone may not help so i remember uh, very clearly about intestinal obstruction situations and uh, certain situations of the gastro tract and also uh, he was mentioning about uh, one of our former politician who had to go to uh, the us for his early lung detection uh, surgery and also uh, oncology of lung actually uh, and surgery done and also orchidectomy so i think if sir could uh, enlighten us on those aspects because we don't want uh, the audience this is meant for the medicals as much as for the public too we don't want this audience of these clips to be biased towards any particular system or methodology we want to get the best of every system and also the best of every procedure and every <coughs> protocol uh, that is being followed so for that reason i think uh, we will make the uh, clip surgery when the situations are. there are certain situations where surgery is needed for example intestinal cancer yeah you are likely to get obstruction mm. uh, you have to immediately intervene yeah. uh, surgical method that yeah. is the only method yeah. but surgery as a cure uh, method of cure it is, there is no indication at mm. all mm. but to relieve obstructions mm. to relieve tension mm. you require uh, very minimal surgical intervention mm. So I don't recommend, sir. Even for carcinoma colon, mm. if there is no obstruction, mm. I won't recommend surgery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There are uh, I have patients, mm. many patients, mm. carcinoma colon. Mm. It is growth is outside the intestine, mm. so there is no block. Mm. Patient is happy mm. and uh, motion is there. Mm. You know, carcinoma of the stomach, mm. no obstruction. Mm. patient is able to swallow mm. there is no obstruction mm. no there is no indication for surgery mm. we are patient is on chemo mm. and siddha uh, supportive treatment like that mm. there are so every case is a, a special case yeah. you have to you can can never generalize mm. that you don't require surgery for cancer mm. you will require surgery in some way Oh, but in breast there is no problem yeah, yeah. because there is no indication of any, yeah. uh, there is no possibility of any obstruction yeah. so there those situations surgery is yeah. and also in prostate the first yes, yeah. prostate also if there is no serious uh, obstruction or anything there is no indication for surgery mm. you can never cure cancer with surgery that is the bottom line if you have i don't know whether you have heard about uh, william frederick cock stated in 1961 mm. that cancer is there if in your uh, in your breast it is there throughout your body yeah mm. is, it is like he said surgery by removing the breast is like removal of the primary chamber of the syphilis of the penis yeah because syphilis is there throughout the body, body yeah. what is the use of removing the primary chamber So the surgery in such can cases is like that treatment. Yeah. That is how Frederick, Frederick yeah. William Frederick said in 1961. Yeah. And sir, about the orchidectomy, that uh, you would say usually that is the symbol. That yeah. is the only treatment indicated. There are so many drugs, mm. so costly. Mm. One injection costs you one lakh, mm. like that. Mm. It is all making money. Mm. It is. companies as well as <laughs> doctors <laughs> there is absolutely no indication in 90% of cancer prostate cases we <laughs> saw always it is about 60% 60 yeah. age yeah but in all those cases <laughs> orchidectomy is the first treatment mm. yeah that itself will make the psa levels come down and yeah. come back to normal mm. uh, for another 10 or 15 years patient mm. it be all right mm. then you if there is any problem you mm. can start on hormones mm. 
female hormone that is a treatment standard treatment yeah. right from the old days yeah. is modern chemotherapy is absolutely useless in carcinoma the moment you have cancer in the prostate it is there throughout the body yeah throughout the skeleton yeah whole bone uh, skeletal as, system is yeah. involved they come as low back ache or yeah, bony yeah. pain yeah invariably there is absolutely no indication for chemotherapy mm. in prostate cancer no. hormone therapy you can try mm. Yes. and i think that can prolong the life to a great extent yes yes, yes yes actually yes but some cases you have complications mm. um, the growth may be faster and all that mm. so in other it's uh, you have to select cases yeah yeah but chemotherapy absolutely useless yeah. and i remember yesterday uh, one of our friends uh, who is attending the opd of sir uh, madam jasmine of chiriyan ashram she was uh, semi seriously telling or asking sir uh, if god appears in front of us and says look anyway i'm going to give you one variety of cancer which would you prefer or uh, what we should we ask for and i think sir was telling if it's a lady he would say see a breast is still better if god has decided for you and if it's a man it is prostate that is still a better cancer to uh, be taken as the verdict of god uh, so i think uh, you would say that the success yes, yes, is high yes, in this yes, too yes 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 